Those don't open. I bet I, t I bet I put initiate together and then that opens. Is what's gonna happen. So it doesn't really matter that I've already guessed it. In fact, it might be obvious on purpose. Oh, it's the clock. I'm like, why is that door making noise? So we have snake, fish, wolf, lion, initiate. These guys. Looks like Stonehenge. It does. Summer 92. Strange way to... Alright. So I have departed for Summer 92, Strange Way 2, Statue of Liberty. What does Strange Way have to do with Statue of Liberty? I'm guessing password, right? One might think. I can't take off that entire thing to look behind it. I don't think I'm gonna get get another one from here either. All right, let's uh, stock sounds. Check out this room next, cause that's where we started. Try the next one over. Okay, the door just closed in my face automatically. That's creepy. Lie. Jack of diamonds. This one can be picked up, but not the other ones. A man's hat looks worn. So everywhere you go, you constantly hear this background noise because they just want to make you constantly hear this camera look, sounding like it's like... It sounds like a hard drive, kind of, you know? Are these all monitor screens? Ah, the attic. A place of forgotten things. Tell me, are you afraid of the dark? I, are they gonna turn the lights off on me? They said, are you afraid of the dark? Is it really the- is this the place of forgotten things? It's a bunch of barrels of something. They, are they gonna forget about their booze? And their pool table? Their ping pong table? You think you'd like these things. By the way, <laughs> clear advantage, this guy has tons of open area, but whoever sits on this- is on the side of the ping pong table is gonna be like slamming into this thing. I found a lens cap next to one of their notes. Using it with a flashlight seems to illuminate hidden symbols all around this house. There must be a reason why they gave me it. Who the hell are these people? For now, I shall press on, but the first sight of- uh, of an escape, I will be taking it. Who's giving you these writing utensils is what I'm starting to wonder. A. I never played this sport, and... I don't... If I don't get out of here, I, ne I, may, I may never. You can play with yourself. Oh, there's the cat. I think we're being too kind. You're being too kind for giving me the basic stuff I'll probably need to solve basic puzzles? Hello, Initiate. As you have probably gathered by now, this house is not a normal one, for this is your trial. Only the truly- only the true enlightened will escape. In doing so, you will be initiated. The choice of joining will ultimately be up to you, but so far, no person has denied our offer. I am sure this will be the same with you, even if you don't believe so at this point. One last thing. We have left you with aid. An aid on this table. I am sure you can find a use for it. Now onto the trials. Lots of symbols, but they're just so haphazardly thrown everywhere that I don't know if they're going to be actually useful for a pa uh, puzzle. Oh, hi. <laughs> uh, boy, does that one stand out. Okay. Let's write down that symbol. Try 
trying to remember what that symbol's called. Is that Gamma? Is that the capital Gamma? Not entirely sure. It stands out from all the other ones, not only because they're put together, but because they're so weirdly, weirdly bright, too. You see me shake them periodically just to see if they make a sound, because that one had stuff in it. And I'm still curious about that. Oh, cool. Blood. Oh, that's a good sign. Alright, so that guy's probably dead. Am I supposed to follow the blood somewhere? Good luck, Initiate. Great. Great. Ah, the door just closed on me in such force that it pushed me. I love playing pool. Now is not the best time for that, though. I've got a candlestick. But I need a lighter. Playing card jack at times. Without a lighter, I can't light it, so I can't figure out what it might do. So I should probably keep it with me in case it shows up somewhere else. Nothing special here, just a regular... just some regular pool cues. Could I possibly find a code for this? Uh, departed for Summer 92, Strange Way 2, Gamma 21. If I really went for it, I could almost be like... Four... Ninety-two... Two... Twenty-one. That's what I thought. <laughs> Just putting them together in a random order. I don't think that's really gonna come together for me, but we do have a safe. Safe code. Oh. Uh, okay. That symbol is apparently equal to 20. So 2021. Then what? That minus 20 equals that. Oh, that's the safe code. Okay. How do you decode that one? Okay, so... Those, are the, those five symbols are the safe code. So, gamma minus 20 equals that. I'm, gonna take, I'm guessing gamma's 21, if that is the way you call that. And if that minus 20 equals that, that means that the diamond equals 1. So the third digit is 1. Great. That gives me one digit. <laughs> Let's see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 digits. First one's a lightning bolt looking thing. Other one looks kind of like a rake or a Y. And there's a top heavy diamond. Alright, so I've written down the symbols themselves. And the one I determined before is that... The diamond equals one. So I have one digit of the sa of the safe combination so far. Went ahead and written down symbols. I think I might have to go around the house to find the rest of the symbols as I continue forward. I don't know why I'd ever turn this off, so it's probably just going to stay on for the rest of the time. So as I find evidence about each symbol's meaning, I can come back here and I can use that information uh, to solve it. Sure. Good luck, initiate. Ah, uh, okay. Y'all are just being weird now. Lie. There's a... purple triangular prism. Red... square prism. White or gray something else. 
Uh, you can't use the UV from this camera angle. I was curious to see if that would bring something up. Lots of blood, apparently. Great. Great. Well, with my new information, let's go back to the first room and see if I can gain new info with my UV light. Alright. That symbol tw equals 22. The horns. Was that Venus? Did we- was it? I'm trying to think back to- oh, oh hey. Neat. That thing fell over and broke. That's what that sound was. The thing that had something inside of it. So I was right to come back. I think that symbol's Venus. I think I remember that being explained in, a uh, 999. There was, like, jokes about it, which helped me remember it, I think. The implication here is that they painted that symbol on the wall, then they put the shelf up. Alright, so it was, uh, Venus 22. I'm just gonna call it Venus at this point, because it's, that helps me remember it. Oh my. Stuck, aren't you? I'm not stuck. Taking my time. That, so 22 minus 19 equals the fork thing. Alright, so that's three. The fork thing is three. So blank, three, one, blank, blank, blank is the combo so far. These doors could just stay open. You kind of have to recheck everything, don't you? Just in case something new shows up. Where the A is gonna go. There we go. Should be pretty easy to spell out initiative. I can just find the rest of the books. All right. So I don't think that one of the one of the digits is given away in the hallway. So we'll try the next door. Fish. Home sweet home. Is whales. The implication that home is Wales. <laughs> home sweet home, yeah, right. Alright, welcome to my notes, Wales. Wales by the fish door. I designed this room personally. I'm very proud of it. Uh, is that why it's extra douchey? Try here, he says. Obnoxiously. Wow, is that one of the initiate books? How could it be? One might even say it's the last one. By which I mean sequentially, not, not the last one remaining. Still need the T. Not sure what that thing is down there. So we have two places to put candlesticks so far, and two candlesticks. Departed 14. It might be a growing, ongoing combination for Departed. Curious about that. We keep finding more Departed. Some kid meets an alien. Some kid, uh... Is... is outside. Why are we doing jump scare sounds? Is the game gonna kill me for going slow or something? <laughs> oh, says this way is north. 
We can only see that with the UV light. Whoa. Okay, so... Rotating it makes the sound play no matter what. I thought the sound was something unlocking. My gift to you, the Ace of Clubs. Orange, blue, red, green. Call... James Tuesday? Is I think what the background says? Which I'm like, I'm like, is that a recycled asset? What's going on there? Orange, blue, red, green. Call James Tuesday. Yep, I'm putting that in my notes too, just in case. But it's so faint that it almost seems like it's a reused asset or something. And they tried to just make it unreadable, which it is in this. It's normally unreadable. Yellow, blue, green, red. It's almost the same colors. It's a yellow instead of an orange. The Grandal. The heck are you? And why is that on the side of it? Random assorted objects, nothing important. I'll be the judge of that, sir. I'm not gonna take your word for it. Because how would you even know? Is that, there's another notebook, just like the one we saw before. It didn't let me open it or anything. Just a regular beanbag. Are these open? What are these, just stairs? For that? There's a toy bunny. Somebody have a baby in here? A two-tier bunk bed. The bottom half is a child's desk. It's covered in useless things. Wow, take that childhood. You designed this room yourself, huh? What's even going on in here? Is there a puzzle in here? Besides the TV that doesn't work? Even though those other things were apparently working? Should, maybe I should make every owl face north? Wait, what? Okay, calm down, soundtrack. Are you implying that's the direction that's north? But the other one says the opposite direction is north. What's going on there? Something fall down and break? Weird. Let's keep going. Poking around. Lion room. We've not put a camera in there because, well, you know. They didn't put a camera in the bathroom, even though it's a test chamber. It's a home improvement magazine. It's open to an article showcasing Italian design. Laundry basket. This one's beginning to smell. Stack of various colored towels. Oh, initiate. Got the tea. Got the tea. Oops. Look up, King of Hearts. 2491. For what? This? Ah, I don't have a key for this, right? We have a chest that requires a key, and we have the code 2491. K, 
Okay, we have a lot of numbers floating around now. We'll try to keep sense of those. What are you, Initiate? I guessed the I guess I guess the quiz before they told me what the question was. Again. Seems to be a thing that I do is guess things before they even tell me what I'm looking for. Another candlestick. There's an assortment of shampoos, sprays, and other amenities. Oh, there's a key in the bath. Whatever this liquid is, I think it stinks. Is that some sort of acid? That's your first guess, huh? This liquid stinks. It must be some kind of death kill stuff. Obviously. Alright, so apparently the key is naughty. And apparently we're doing some Saw-style, like, na nasty, nasty, uh, murder games going on here. I don't think any of these are going to help me get through that. My inventory is wholly unhelpful at dealing with acid. What I need is something that's base. Doesn't soap have base in it? Soap is basic, so... It'd... I'd be curious to see if it's valid to take all of these different shampoos and pour them into the bath, and then you could nullify the acid with a base, and then you just get water, more or less. There's a missing pipe. Okay. That's probably how I drain it. Maybe. Although, do you think that it would just drain out into this room and just spew acid on the floor or something? Huh. Kind of skipped a door. Ah. Never mind. I apparently can't get past a small chair. Okay, it's not like our life depends on any of this, I'm sure. Is this the code? 2491? Okay. Didn't work at first. Congratulations, Initiate. It seems as though you have made it past the first section of the trial, however, this is just the beginning. But I'm sure you will make it past the rest to claim your reward of enlightenment. I bet you can't wait. Up until now, things have been easy. But rest assured, that will change. Have fun. They're claiming it'll be hard now. We'll see about that. Looking for more code pieces. Gotta check every wall, just in case. Enlightened. Yes, by the way, the notes are getting quite dense at this point, due to lack of context on how to even sort them and what might be relevant to what. But I'm guessing it's the portrait stuff is all relevant to the other portrait stuff, perhaps? Blue candle. I'm guessing we need an orange candle now, based on that one note I read. Red, orange, green, blue. There once stood a great city of wise owls, hidden high amongst the clouds where everyone lived in perfect harmony. Its ruler, the king, was revered, for he was mystical, magical, and very powerful. Any owl with a problem could come to hi aid his council for guidance. And many did. One day a small fledgling owl went to see the king to ask a question. No one knew of what the young fledgling owl said to the king, but the king was most furious. He was so angry that he cast the young owl out of the city, to the dismay of all of its residents. And thus the young owl lived alone on the outskirts of the city, where every day was a fight for survival. With each passing year, the animosity of the young owl grew stronger, for in his mind his punishment was without warrant. And so he plotted revenge. Huh. The 
but there was a king owl, a city of owls, and then an owl that was kicked out. And that's all we really have to go on. Something about revenge comes later. I was hoping for information about what direction to face the owls, because this seems like this series of... It seems like this story might indicate, uh... In some way, where, like, where those things are supposed to face. Because there's so far two owls you can rotate for some reason, and I'm sure that's going to actually come up and not just be a weird throwaway detail. That's creepy. There's an under area. Don't plan on going there yet, but I'm looking for any writing on the walls. I want to I want to clear this hallway as much as I can first before I move anywhere else. That shit's falling over again. Why is stuff shaking in this house so much? It's worth asking. It's a snake-shaped house ornament. Thanks, game. Is this trial too difficult for you? She lies, she lies, it says. Graduation one. Just adding it to the list. The Eiffel Tower. Because now we've had a second case. Keep looking. Isn't that interesting? That ticking noise. What was weird is that when I was opening and, and closing them, it had a ticking noise, and... I thought that would be some kind of indication of, like, you're making some sort of puzzle progress, but it might not be at all. You're beginning to remember. Okay. Ah. Tell me, what did you remember? A family member? A friend? Your interview with us, perhaps? We have owl number four now. Still not sure what to make of them. They all say north forward when that's not true. Return the six. Are they all statues or something? And how do I return them if this thing doesn't open? Odd. Two factions of owls fought furiously. Face them correctly for this game to begin. Two factions of owls fought furiously. How do you tell if they're factions? Huh. Let's keep going and maybe I'll find more owls and better context about which way to face them overall. 